These police officers were flabbergasted. They were in disbelief. They couldn't believe how fast this young lady was. I already knew where she got that training from. You see, when you were trained at the Hood Olympics, you know they train you well on how to outrun the police on foot. That's right. This young lady was barefooted and outrun the police. She left them behind for miles. After they caught her, they had to congratulate her on how fast she was. Hey, man, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you like, share, subscribe, leave a comment in the comment section, and let me know what you guys think about this video here in the comments. And with that said, let's get into this one. Officers from the Glendale Police Department in Wisconsin discovered a stolen BMW. Acting efficiently, officers preemptively organized numerous spike strips to stop this suspect from escaping. With heavy traffic during the afternoon rush hour, officers devise a plan to quickly spike the vehicle to limit speeds should the driver flee. BMW too? Don't let these cars go. Oh. Turn your lights and hit it. I like the Terminator. Dude, we're gonna be making a felony stop, 1300 block of 13 cents. So much break. Nope. Got stuck. Looks like we're in pursuit. She said, miss me with that. Silver spring. cutting through traffic like that? According to police reports, the suspect lost control of the vehicle and slammed into the back of a utility vehicle that was surrounded by workers. Immediately afterwards, she flees on foot. Ow! Since the incident wasn't Yay. fully caught on dash cam, our team of volunteers worked to obtain security camera footage of the crash. She is moving! Seven for two, vehicles clear. What are you in a maze? What do you have eyes on? Are you guys all okay? Alright. Nah, ain't no way. My girl left them in the smoke. She's gone. Crash, hopped out, and moving. You could tell. This is not her first rodeo. She's experienced at this. This ain't no, this nothing new to her. Crash the car, hop out, run. Go north on Bayshore Drive. Damn, they really lost, they really lost her. Go ahead, I'll Stole save the car. Oh. According to police reports, this officer was able to gain ground on the suspect. She eventually gave up and laid down on the ground before the officer reached her. Unfortunately, the report also indicates that the officer was in the middle of sinking his body camera to his cruiser when the incident occurred, preventing us from witnessing that full scene. My girl did all of that. 
running, jumping over objects, barefooted. <laughs> she did all of that running. No shoes on, not even a Crocs, sandals, nothing. Just barefooted. Nah, I'll give it to my girl. Oh, hell no. Nah. The police report indicated that the mall had outdoor security cameras that may have captured the scene. We had our team of volunteers obtain the footage. However, the cameras were set to automatically pan, tilt, and zoom in various angles. Unfortunately, all cameras that could have captured the scene were facing away from the apprehension when it occurred. Hack a mall. Where's your shoes? My man tired. He said, hell nah, she too fast for me. I'm about to retire next year. I can't be running like this. You know what he needs right now? Gatorade. That's right. That's exactly what my man needs right now. Over. We're going to get you some breath, okay? Stand up. Just sit up. Sit up. She done now. Just catch your breath, all right? Just catch your breath. Well, probably out of breath. Catch your breath. You good? Let's no, no let's get her up and put her on the bench over there. Stand breath. breath. Okay. One, two, three. Oh, we got squads right here. Oh, she a little one. Look how tiny she is. Looking like my daughter. You hear the music? You're just out of breath, right? Yeah. How old are you? Oops, sorry. How old are you? 21. She's in the wrong profession. She'd be in the Olympics. What's your name? What's your first name? Come on, you shouldn't be that out of breath. You're 21 years old. After her arrest, court documents suggest that the 21-year-old suspect would remain under strict supervision until her verdict was decided roughly five months later. She faced charges for operating without the owner's consent, fleeing, obstructing, and second-degree recklessly endangering safety. She eventually submitted a guilty plea. For second-degree recklessly endangering safety, she was sentenced one year in the House of Corrections, but that sentence was stayed. Instead, she will face two years of probation, with the potential for 60 days at the House of Corrections upon her parole agent's discretion. All other charges were dismissed, but read in. She is legally restricted from possessing firearms and voting. What the f So we can't touch anything yet. Oh, no, I'm not. Because I need, I need to uh, get the photos, go right to accident report. Yeah, no, I'm not going to. I just wanted to see. Is it a company truck or what? Yeah. Okay. I was up on the ladder. I'll sit right here. All right, this was here. I might have went all the way up. Yeah. All right. Well, I'll just stay out of you guys' way. And I would have gotten away with it, too, if not for you meddling human meat sack. Yes, Wisconsin. What do we expect? Pretty much everything over there to slap on the wrist. She did all of that. Danger in lives. Multiple traffic violations, crashed a car, stole the car. Says she took it from someone without their permission. That is pretty much stealing. Not sure how much damage is done to the car, but it's a BMW. So you know that is not cheap to fix. And that's all she got. Gotta thank the system, right? What has happened to our system? This is what happens when our system is compromised. By individuals like you just saw on this video. Tell me in the comments if I'm lying or not. A whole lot of DEI hires. Only 21 years old and this is the life she chose. Steal a car, high speed chase, crash the car, caught up in the system. At 21 years old, that's the only thing you could think about doing with your life and your youth. But they don't know how quick time goes before you know it. You're in your late 20s, 30s, that's wasting time. But for a lot of these individuals, it's all fun and games, right? But when you want to go out there and take the police on a high-speed chase and crash your car, you're going to win stupid prizes. But I give her credit. She's fast on the foot, but she didn't last that long. That stamina eventually ran out. Hey, man, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you like, share, subscribe. Leave a comment in the comment section. And let me know what you guys think about this video here in the comments. And until then, I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. You guys have a blessed day.